uh, do you know what the world really needs? Fingerprints. They need some sort of identification that will help um, ascertain from one person from another and they need it for the common people as well as the law. The police in New South Wales, Australia, are currently trying to get the government to support a movement to get all Australians on a database with fingerprints and blood tests uh, in storage for when they need to diagnose a homicidal case or a missing person or a murder. This way they'll be able to um, resolve cases faster However, some are opposed against this. They won't they won't wear a mask on society. And a person will ask why. Simply because some people are hiding from the law. They're hiding from themselves and they're hiding from the people they know. Some people can't distinguish one person from another. They kind of look the same. They look like circles. But obviously one is a little different from the other. In the human world such things are given leniencies. People can look like other people, and this is um, why some people think they can go towards abducting another person's life. Some people call it identity theft, some people call it outright ab abductions. Just think someone looking like your parent or grandparent, brother or sister is able to link themselves into another person's world just because they look kind of similar. But they are totally different. Some people even look like identical twins. And they don't even have... They don't even have the difference. And this is a shocking revelation when you meet it. But some people can look like two exact circles, but they are different people as well. And they come from different families and different genetics. Or sometimes they're half-breeds of um, one person's genetics. Um, and sometimes they've just been um, a person's child thrown away. And it can even be the person who they're trying to body double for. And that is why they're sort of similar. Except they are totally different and they should not be regarded as the same. They're not actually friends. They're two different people, and if one switches for another person, then that is called abduction. And for some people, they don't have the knowledge to be able to decipher from A, from A to B, or B to A. They think all oh, persons are on drugs. They're trying to get off on having a split personality. But sometimes they really seem different, and everyone wonders if they are different. In World War II and one, people came home looking and feeling a little bit different. They had different personalities and this made their families alarmed. They complained to the government in order to tell them